Hello, you're with Calling All Stations, and I hope you're all having a wonderful and very happy holidays. Welcome to the very wintry and snowy Dormally Station in the Scottish Highlands. I just thought I'd give you a little update, as a lot of you have been asking where I've gone and why I'm not uploading at the moment. Basically, long story short, had a lot of things going on over the summer, a few personal things that needed taken care of, going to be starting a new job in January, going to be moving house. It's all chaos at the moment, so I've had to take a back seat from um, social media and uploading for a while. So yeah, some of the model railway stuff is all sort of being packed up at the moment, waiting for the move. I'm not sure what the future of it is going to be. I'm sure there will be a future, but at the moment it's all just kind of on hold. So do bear with me. I'm not going to make any promises when I'm going to be back. I just know I will be at some point. However, I've made the time to make this special Christmas, New Year's, end of season video for you. It's not actually going to be here in the Scottish Highlands. It's going to be back in London with the team who I will hand over to now. Have a great Christmas. Have a great New Year's. Guys, I will see you when I see you. Thanks for subscribing, thanks for all your support. Do stay tuned, I'll be back when I can. See you soon. Need to find out. Hello, you're with Calling All Stations. What's this? It's most direct. Well, and a note. A very Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to you all. Welcome to the 16 Lines of Christmas Challenge. I couldn't think of a better title. You will notice that enclosed in this letter is an up-to-date standard tube map. Yep. That one there, I imagine. Your mission is to travel on all 16 lines noted on this map in the quickest time possible. The first team back to Broadcasting House at the top of Regent Street wins. Your rules are as follows. You must travel at least one stop on each of the 16 lines noted in the key. This includes the standard 11 tube lines, the overground, TFL rail, the DLR, tramlink and the cable car. Normal tube challenge rules apply. You may use buses and national rail routes to make connections, but you may not use taxis, cabs or cycle hires. You may start when the clock strikes 12 o'clock. Good luck. You may start when the clock strikes 12. You may start when the clock strikes 12. Good luck. Top. Right, go. Right, okay. Hello, by the way. Um, the trams are going to make this difficult, aren't they? Yes. I'm going to introduce you to my teammate for the day. This is Alex, who Hello. is currently wandering around King's Cross looking for a bin. I mean, Wimbledon is like the nearest bit of tram, isn't it? Yeah, I think, I think that's... Well, we're already in the south. I'm surrounded Full by stop. things that look like bins. None of which are bins. <laughs> District, no, that's going to take ages. District, Victoria Line? I think, well, at least that's one ticked off then if we do the Victoria Line. Should we just, should we sit here and think about it for a while or should we just go gun home? I reckon we'll just go gun home. Yeah, we'll just go gun home. Right. To Stockwell? Yep, we can see a loop going on there. So we've got another five minutes. Alex is going to go find a bin. Otherwise, we're sponsored for the whole trip. <laughs> Clapham, head towards Clapham Junction. Overground, good call. And then maybe cut across to Wimbledon. There is a clock up there. I think the St Pancras clock is running one minute behind. We've got 10 seconds to go, looking at internet time. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. go. Well, it's the start of a plan anyway. It's a plan. Do it. Right. This is 
Victoria line. Not that, you're, not that you're biased in any way. No, obviously. But we've got to start. It's Victoria, I'm Victoria. Victoria all the way, right? And until they open the David line, it's the only option we've got. <laughs> here, here, here. Instinct's telling me to head east. We've got DLR, TFL Rail, Dangle Way to tick off. So we'll go east. We're, and we'll knock out these three lines in one go. So we've got Hammersmith and City Line coming in now. And we are going to have to jump out and travel on. Let's tick off some lights. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Have you got a pen? I have got a pen. We're going to need a pen. <laughs> so we're only nine minutes in. Already we've ticked off one. We're about yep. to tick off the second one, Number which is the Northern Line. Stockwell is where we currently are. Yeah. Stockwell. So it was quite good going so far. Who knows it could be in the lead. But we have no communication with Carter at all. No. So we have no idea. This is we're going to stop. Well, no, we're at Stockwell. I don't know if you can see that. That's going incredibly well. So we've got an all gate next. So it's going to be Metropolitan Line. We'll go down to Barbican, jump out, Circle Line, all gate. We've already done three lines. Bish bash boss, three line knocked if out. If we carry on like this, we'll have, we'll have done it in an hour. We've basically won. <laughs> It is 12.14. 14 minutes. We're already hitting the overground. We're doing well. We will win. Do that again. We will win. I don't know when the next train is. This is a problem. I like the tube where they're like every two minutes. Overground, more to itself. Underground, overground, wumbling free. <laughs> the next one's at 25 minutes past. So what? Oh no. Seven minute lag. Hope that doesn't cost us in the end. I'll sit and read the paper then. Right, so we've got to head east. We know that because we've got to do TfL Rail on the Dangle Way. So I'm thinking we head to Liverpool Street. Now the question is, do we get off at Moorgate, go down the Northern, come back up to the Central, the Bank? The only thing is we've got to go through Bank on the Waterloo and City Line. So I'm reckoning save that all for later and just head straight to Liverpool Street. And we've done a quick change and we're now at Clapham High Street. Now the thought process is that we then go from Clapham High Street to Clapham Junction. And then from there we can hopefully catch a regular train. I know it doesn't count in the challenge, but we can get the train to Wimbledon. It is allowed in the rules, so that's what we're doing. Once we get to Wimbledon, bit of tram, back up again, district line. If we can knock off the trams nice and early, because they're the tricky bits, that'd be good. Conspicuously well. Yes, it is. Hammersmith and City Line, Circle Line, Metropolitan Line, done. We're heading east. We're going to go and get TfL Rail and head to Stratford. And then we'll start to do some awkward things when we get to Stratford. Oh, it's busy, it's busy. Ground. Now at Clapham Junction. It's, I really like and hate simultaneously because there's just so many trains and so many platforms. We need to get to platform 11. Train. I don't think we're going to catch the 33. I had a little look on my phone to see what time the trains were. We might not catch the 33, but hopefully we'll catch the 36. Get to London. Why am I doing this? Really? Are you up for your first bit of swift movement? I'm ready. <laughs> A couple of minutes, uh, platform 16, I think it was for Shenfield. Was it platform 16? Was that 15 or 16 up there? 
16. 16. Let's go. Yeah, I did say to myself yesterday <laughs> I would not run for any <laughs> I know, but I want to win. There is a new crossrail unit waiting in the platform, but sadly look, that's not ours. First year running, how do you feel? <laughs> Smashed it. <laughs> Feeling every, every uh, gram of that McDonald's. <laughs> Right, we're at Wimbledon, so we're going to dash and find a tram. I have no idea which direction we're in. Trams, trams, I see trams. Go tram. So I wonder what Victoria's doing. They started at Victoria. Victoria, David started at Victoria, that's a mouthful. That's a tram. That's, a tram. that's definitely a tram. I think if they've got any sense, they'll be heading straight to Croydon. But it doesn't matter because we don't have to actually go anywhere on the tram. We just have to get on it at some point and go somewhere and come back. Yeah, so we're coming back here. Basically, we're just going to gonna get on the first tram we see. Because the difficult part of this challenge, I'm starting to work out, and it's incredibly clever by Tom, is tramlet is going to be the big problem for us both. So we're going to go one stop. Um, Donald Road. Because it's so out of the way and it doesn't really connect with it. And then we can either walk back, or if there's a tram straight away, put the tram back. I think it's a seven minute walk back, so... So we're going to pick, we're going to have to pick that up later on in the day, because we've just headed east. Um, but if they've got any sense, they will start the tram. And they will go down to Croydon. I'm very interested to know what Victoria is doing right now. So yeah, next stop, back to Wimbledon, District Line. District line. This could take some time. Not again. <laughs> Jubilee line. <laughs> Which one we want? Tower Hill. Rolling. Line number five. Yep. District line. There's a little slog coming up. Yeah, so we're going to essentially go all the way up to Earl's Court, then get a big D line train, and then get to Hammersmith and all the first. But first, sandwiches. Sandwiches, yes, sandwiches. So we're going to go down to Canning Town. Lovely, our job. Um, the trick is don't get distracted by the DLR. We could, of course, get the DLR straight to Royal Victoria. So that's going to take ages, got more stops, so we're going to jump on the Jubilee line, tick that off already, so that's done. Canning Town, DLR, Dangleway, and then we're going to start to get slowed down, I think. Our breath. <laughs> Awkward station, because there's DLR over there behind us, and there's DLR upstairs. Both of which go to Beckton, so we've got some working out to do. Quite key, we don't get this bit wrong. Very confused. So confused. Way out, it says way out that way. Oh, that's not a down. Oh god, where's the down? Beckton, platform two. That's what we want. How do we get there? Platforms one and two, that's what we want. Platform Canning two. Town, what a nightmare. It says way out one way and then it's not a way out the other way. First awkward interchange of the day, I'd say. Hopefully that noise is not our train. Right, so, we can do the line. Best seats in the house. Bit of confusion there at Canning Town. Couldn't work out how to get outside the Jubilee Line platforms. This should be line six. We've got ten more to go. Easy. Dangleway next, although that's going to slow us down. Very exciting though. First time on Dangleway. You've never been on the Dangleway? Never been on the Dangleway. We're going to have some lovely views and we're going to be slowed down. What do you think Victoria's doing and David? West. So, we're at Hammersmith. I think they've gone west. Okay. We need to change the other Hammersmith. And then House of the City line, and then possibly switch trains halfway through if there's a circle line coming as well, because we need to tick that one off as well. And even though it's 
basically the same line. I know. We have to get on a train that is actually a circle line train. And this is going against all of my natural, like, Londoner commuterness. Yeah. Doing, like, one stop here and one stop there. But we will beat Carter. As well, so, so far, Victoria Line, Line, Overground, Tram, District, Piccadilly, Hammersmith and City. This is Hammersmith. And here, so that's where we're aiming for. At some point, we need to change and get on a circle line train. Might be waiting about a bit, and it's really counterintuitive. Basically, the only option is to get back on the Jubilee line. I reckon this is the point we now head south and attack Tramlink. The problem with Tramlink is we could cover it at Wimbledon, which is closer to town, and we could go in from Waterloo. But then we're going to have to double back, whereas if we go down to Croydon, we'll, we'll tick off the overground as well. But yeah, this is the bit that's really going to slow us down, because we're going to go back onto the Jubilee line. We've already done the Jubilee line, so we're now, we're now sort of wasting time. So we're having a lovely dangle. Lovely, but, lovely, old dangle. lovely old dangle, but... We are, we are now wasting time. The only thing that we've got to remember is Victoria and David do have to come and dangle at some point, so they are going to have to waste as much time as we're wasting. Anyway, back to some planning. We've got to work out how we're going to cover most of the other tube lines, because we haven't even thought about that yet. So it's pretty much been Tramlink, Tramlink, Tramlink. Tramlink. Worry about Tramlink, and then the rest will come into place. Right, we'll see you in a bit. Please be circle line, please be circle line, please be circle line, please be circle line. Yes! Circle line, woo, look at that! It looks exactly like the train we just got off at. Because it's exactly the same as the train we just got off, but marginally different in that it has circle line written on the front. Yeah. I don't understand it either, viewers, but we have to do it. So, another quick change of station. We're going to come out of here, which is Wood Lane, TV centre across the road. White Pass City the is down boss. there, that's where we need to get to the central line. Come with me. Take care of the stairs, platforms, and in ticket hall areas. Canada Water. Canada Water. I think we've landed bang in the middle of the waiting time for the next train. You said it was about 15 minutes between each service? Yeah, and it's seven minutes to the West Croydon. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Could have been, been better. It's, it's, it could have been better. So we've got a bit of a wait here. The overground is generally going to be slow down to Croydon, and then we're going to be in Croydon. We are very far out of town, so this is where we're really slowed down. Right, welcome to Croydon for Tramlink. Where are you, Andy Carter? Are you in one of these pods? One more, and we still don't know how well the other team is doing. We're just waiting for the platform to be available. Is it northbound? There's nobody here. We just missed it. 